Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Sips Loud channel. So Nikki and Future did this amazing collaboration, and she definitely dragged a lot of people in this song. It's called Press Play, and she did gave a lot of shade to Cardi B. She said, I am your label's obsession. Use another guinea pig top of every list, including your man bucket. Now, we all know that Nikki has been vocal about Atlantic Record wanted to sign her, but she ditched and she signed with Lil Wayne Young Money. And ever since, she said Atlantic has been coming for her whole career. So they got Cardi B. You know, they signed Cardi B because they know that this girl was apparently an exotic dancer who was really desperate at the time to be a rapper. So it's alleged that Atlantic Record, you know, told Cardi B, in order for you to gain a lot of fame, you got to create this beef with Nicki. So Nicki explained a lot of that. She said Cardi B was on people's payroll. People pay her to beef with me. Okay, and I kind of see where it makes sense because a lot of things that Cardi B was saying about Nikki were not true. There were no evidence about Nikki mentioning anyone's child. Okay, and Nikki definitely cleared up that rumor. We all see the video where Cardi B was at attacking Nikki. Like that is no hidden secret. We all saw that video. So I love that Nikki is sticking up for herself and the fact that she has been releasing a lot of music even though she just dropped her own album people are like the album has flopped pink friday too flopped hence why she has to drop more tracks to keep up and to chart on billboard now people are like where is cardi b why isn't cardi b responding why hasn't cardi b put out any song the thing is I heard, okay, and this is a rumor. I heard Cardi B is planning a album this year. So she is working, working, working on it. And I know she's going to drag Nikki. Like that's the only way Cardi B will chart and sell music if she creates this beef with Nikki and if she subs Nikki and JT and those other rap girls. Okay. That's the only way Cardi B makes music. And that is just my own opinion. Y'all do not have to agree. OK, also, I think the fact that she told the Internet that she and Offset is no longer dealing, that could be a whole benefit for Cardi B's album. You know, she made songs in Invasion of Privacy about bre breakups and falling off with relationships and such. I think this is going to be an Invasion Privacy too. OK, hence why she has to tell people that she and Offset are no longer dating and there's problems within their marriage. So it could be beneficial to the type of album that she is about to put out. But as promised, Nikki is saying she is never going to back down and she is going to retire when she feels like it. And I'm super here for that because I genuinely do not believe people telling you when to quit or when to walk away from your craft. You know, that's lame vibes. It means that they cannot stand the competition, but I'm super here for the mess. But let me know what y'all think down below in that comment section. And thank you for sipping with us.